Hello everyone, welcome to this video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can fix Pinterest app not loading pins. So if the Pinterest app is not loading pins then this video I'm going to show you a variety of ways on how you can basically fix this. Starting with fix number one, all we need to do is make sure that we have a proper Wi-Fi connection. If you don't have a proper Wi-Fi connection, then this could cause issues with pins not loading on Pinterest. So just make sure that you have a proper Wi-Fi connection. Now, once you've double checked that and it's still not working, you may want to just try and update the app to the latest version. By doing this, it will fix, fix a lot of bugs and it will also just completely refresh the entire app. So just type in Pinterest and maybe try to update the app if there's a potential update available. Now, if that still did not fix your issue, then what you can simply do is head over to the app like this. Go to the bottom right corner of your screen and then the top right corner of your screen at settings. Once you've done that, click on privacy and data and then scroll down until you find clear app cache. Just click on it once, then reopen the app to see if maybe that fixes your issue. Now, if it still did not fix your issue, then what you can do is actually clear the cache over on the settings app on your iPhone. To do this, open settings and then simply scroll down to general, click on iPhone storage and then just scroll down until you find the Pinterest app. So let me quickly find it. It's going to be somewhere in this list right here. So the app is right here. All we need to do is click on it. Once you've done that, click on offload app, wait a few seconds and then click on reinstall app back again using this page. And basically once you've done that, you should be good to go and you can see if maybe that fixed your issue. Now, if it still did not fix your issue, then what you can also just simply try and do is restarting your device. To do this, quickly press the volume up button, then quickly press the volume down button and then press and hold the power button. Till your entire screen goes dark, you want to keep on holding that power button till that Apple logo appears and once an Apple logo appears, just let go and you can check to see if that maybe fixed your issue. Now, if that still did not fix your issue, basically force restarting your entire device, what you can then do is simply reinstalling the app for the latest fix. So to do that, hold down the app on your home screen, click on remove app and then reinstall it back again using the App Store. Do know that when you do that, all your documents and data will be removed, so keep that in mind. But basically, by just reinstalling an app, it will fix 99% of the issues you are having with a certain app. So yeah, I would just recommend trying that if none of the other fixes fix it for you. And that's basically all I have for you in this video. So if you learned something from this video, then please consider liking this video and subscribing to my channel. And that being said, I hope I will see you in my next YouTube tutorial video.